Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, and those of you who know what the hell you are yet. Hop along PR here. We are back playing Legend of Hero blah, 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 Legend of Heroes, Trails in the Sky the Third. Alright, so I just set up my dudes with their orb and stuff, and I forgot how just um what's what I want to use. Lovely. <laughs> it is trying to get all these combinations again. But enough about that. I wanted to point out something that I just find hilarious. So I missed the second line of what the dude said. You guys pointed out to me, and the doors of Gehenna opened, is what he said. Which is completely accurate to what's happening now. I am stepping into hell. Trails in the sky, hell. So, I just wanted to share that little bit of irony that I just, it just made me happy on the inside. Oh. I'll never get tired of how space looks, even in video games. Check this out. Looks like it really was an entrance of sorts. Huh. So, is a good amount of the game going to be in here? That'd be interesting. Like, whatever this is, it's clearly... Really, really powerful. How they pick out of nowhere? It doesn't matter. Hmm. Yes. Both of you can go now. Can just go fuck right off. All right, it's not looking good so far, but then again, it's kind of, you know, be expected with this. Unless I have her as my healer, I mean, have him as my healer slash spellcaster right now. You guys can just leave me alone for like one second. That's all I'm asking for. Hmm. I think I'll just use Kevin's grail. See, what do I want to do? Nothing in here. There we go. Nice and lined up. No, I do not want to use any of those because if I'm going to use him, I, I, I caught myself this time. Hmm. Let's just have him attack. Bone Warrior. Ooh. I had space attacks. You know what? Let's trade blows with him. Even though this is overkill, I don't care. I need to survive. I don't want this death counter to get as high as I think it's going to. I will do what, I've, what I did with the um, previous episode and... I'll let you guys see all the times that I die. It's gonna it be condensed, but you only see, you know, why the death counter is so high. Cool. If you guys could just, you know, focus on hitting the girl for a second, I would greatly appreciate that. There's one. Damn it. This isn't good. No, Kevin, it is not. No way. Poop. I was not prepared. Do you all warn me? I have no one to blame but myself. All right, real question. Raise your hand if you guys try yelling at me. You do have 
that type of attack. Because, I don't know, I thought it was just like... Oh, that's right. Since you died, you don't get as much. But I thought it was just um, a thing to cause a status to buff. Or abnormal status, there we go. So that's my bad there. How could this be? I know exactly what you mean. There are a whole lot of monster types in our world. That's my first time seeing any like that. It's being a totally different realm. Huh! I wonder why that is, Kevin! The monsters don't even... weren't even the strangest part. Tell me about it. The elements against them weren't the usual affair either. Exactly. The elements of space, mirage, and time were... Okay, so they're not used to be having the higher elements in effect. Very observant, Rookie. Didn't think he'd notice that to that extent. No, no. I fucking did. That's the only way I won. This point said he had another clue that we're a long ways from home. I mean, you'll probably find a buttload of monsters you're weak to fire in Zamaria, but you're not going to find any of that are weak to Mirage. You know how it is. Indeed I do. Spiritually, the world in which we live is a relatively low plane of existence. Quote the Testaments. Our world and the world of the goddess will be forever separate. The supply... Eh. She simply drops pebbles from above, known as miracles. Quoting word for word. Though, hey, I guess those are basic principles. We just need to keep running to surprises. Space, time, and mirage. All here. Should be impossible. What those monsters themselves? Honestly, they're like less monsters and more fiends. Creatures that shouldn't be allowed to exist in our world, and yet somehow without any problems here. I doubt that those are the only ones. We're gonna be all right in here? Hopefully. They were tough, but not so tough we couldn't handle them if we're together. It's like anything else for us to do back in the other base area. Let's keep walking and see what we find, I say. Maybe we'll work while back briefly, check our orbit setups, seeing as we've got more elements to come for now. True. Oh, Kevin, let me give you this. Monster guide. What's this for? For the monster guide. It's designed to record data on monsters, their habits, weakness, and the like. It would be wise for us to know anything and everything we come across here. Although I suppose fiend guide would be most appropriate here. <laughs> tell me. You sure I can't just store all this info up in the old noggin, though? I've already put enough, enough stuff for the Grail's letter notebook as it is. My hands are going to go numb at this rate. You complain way too much, Kevin. You're a knight. Do your job. <sighs> Yes, ma'am. You sound like the present, I guess. Skibbles. There. Happy? I'll be happy, you know, when I can go back and heal. So. Higher elements that are in effect here. I only have, um... I think it's Mirage and Time. I don't have a technical space one. You know, I've been playing these games for... Wait. Okay, so Sands a week. I've pretty much done an upload every day. The first two were in, like, the 80s or 70s. I've been playing this game franchise for almost an entire year straight. I still don't know everything. Oh. Cool. All right, you bitches can stay the same. Please, for my sake. Fuck. Well, at least he left. Oh, fuck. I did not see death blow. I was not prepared. Come on, guys, you had the preemptive strike. That slime thing. The fuck, dude? All right, so fire's the way to go if I want to do anything to it. But I will pass in order I don't want that to happen again it probably is I can just say I don't want that to happen again 
Oh, cool. It didn't happen again. There's one. Wait. Okay, I know you guys probably already know this, but, or don't know this, but we don't know at this point who the master is. We just know that it's a dude you probably don't want to fuck with. So, um, these like red sheens, or oh, red lights that come out of them. I don't know why. It reminds me of Loe's um, sword. Yeah, no fucking idea why. But... You ought not to have done that, Sonny. It's quite stupid of you. Though I don't know if you know you have a brain left in there. Clearly, you're a skeleton. So I can assume, you know, your innards have long since gone away. But, um, as I was going back to, um, heal, something occurred to me. Now, I'm not 100% sure on the hierarchy for the church, but Kevin is up there. And if this is something completely new to him, then I can only assume that this... Oh, fuck right off. Is relatively unknown in this universe. Meaning that church doesn't really know what to do with it. Or not familiar with it. And I don't know, that just makes you think, what is this? What exactly did the ancient Zumerian race... Well, I've already, I don't want to say, come to the conclusion that they were people from another planet who came here for God knows whatever reason. But other than that, what type of not only technology, but magic did they have at their disposal? Because you can't do this with all technology alone. I can assure you that. Um, yeah, that's fine. Why do you always hit the girl? Really, though, why? All right, so we got that going, but that's just something that I thought of just who, what, why were these people the way they were? Teleporters, okay. Oh, you know. Not going that way. Bye, bitch. And don't worry, I will be doing all level grinding off screen, so you don't gotta worry about that. What's this? It's really pretty. It's like a cube of sepium. I don't think that's what it is. You should touch it and see what happens. <laughs> way to go, Kevin. Ceiling stone. Does it seem harmful? Nope, seems safe to me. Although I wish I knew what it was. Light coming off, it's so warm. Kind of slow, rhythmic glowing. That reminds you of beating heart in a way. What was that? That's our cube again. Visitor from afar. You who possess the cube. Is that the voice from earlier? Just who are you? Why are you talking to us from? Raise the ceiling stone before the monument in the garden. Then the barrier and the imprisoned shall... What you get is we need to take this thing to the monument. I will unlock another power cube. Make use of it. Are you just going to take me back to the base? Yay! That's useful. What the? Beware the malevolent one. Gather strength 
and you two will be forever stuck here. Um, don't even ask. I feel like I'm in some kind of weird dream that gets freakier by the minute. I don't sense anything bad coming from the voice, at least. Maybe it's trying to guide us forward. True, it does. You don't think the cube has a will of its own and that it's talking to us, do you? I doubt it. Kept talking about the cube as if it was a separate object. Much as the source of the voice is somewhere else. And that malevolent one was bringing up too. See that being the man in black we saw when we were thrown here. I thought it could very easily be someone else. Oh, this is starting to make my head hurt. And my stomach grumble. Join the club. I'll try to take things one step at a time, okay? I don't know. Best place to start is probably giving the cube's new power a shot. You're serious? Serious as it can be. There aren't many artifacts that have the power of teleportation, you know. The situation we're stuck in, we need to use everything we got at our disposal. All right. Be sure you're careful when using it. I will. <laughs> Just don't do it willy-nilly. Ooh, oh. I am going to be here the entire game. Because this has got to be a ring. This has got to be a rung. This, maybe. Probably. That, 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 and that. Hmm. If that is the case then, then how are we going to get other party members? Will they be warped in here? Oh. Alright, that actually worked. We got a quick way to get back here safely if we weren't into danger. Like all the time? That does sound useful. Oh, my bad. But the, still, I can't bring myself to put much trust in that cube, however. Oh, I'm not planning to lower my guard around the thing either. I'll keep using it with caution, so don't worry. Anyway, next up's this little guy. That ceiling stone? Voice made it sound like something we would be released from it if we hold it up to the monument. God damn it. Sorry, my mouse keeps wandering. Any guesses? Nope, but I know when we find out. I'll handle holding it up, but I want you to stand, be prepared for a fight in case. Got no idea what we're dealing with here. Understood. Something's happening. All right. Time for the moment of truth. What's going to happen? What boon do you have for us? It looks pretty. All right. So there's that gone now. So we can progress that way. This is cool and all, but unless you start doing something. What? Uh, girl. Where? Dita? What was that light? Isn't it the girl from the professor's photograph? Huh? Kevin? You are Kevin, aren't you? I'm not seeing things. What are you doing here? Where do I even start? Oh, but yeah, it's for real. Good to see you again, Dita. Looks like you've grown a little taller. You noticed? Happy to see you again, too. What brings you back to Liberal? Is this girl a friend of yours? Okay, she noticed. Wait. I was in the house with Dad getting dinner, be ready because Agate was coming over, and all of a sudden, everything went white, and then... And then... Where am I? This looks nothing like our house. Am I dreaming? Is this all a dream? All right, just pinch myself, check. Uh, yep. This is the deed everyone knows and love, all right. She's adorable. <laughs> yeah. Oh, so that's what happened. It's all because that artifact mom pulled out of the lake? Honestly, we can't even be sure right now. Especially if we assume that's the case. How did you end up here when you're all way over in Zeiss? Makes no sense. You're right. Sounds like you two are fairly close to another one when you were sent here. But Gransel and Zeiss are far apart. Based on your account, however, we were all surrounded by the light roughly at the same time. That's more than a coincidence in my eyes. Yeah, I think so too. Oh, whoops. I haven't introduced myself, have I? 
Name's Dita Russell. I'm an apprentice at Zeiss Central Factory. I'm Rai Sargent, a sister of the Septian Church. I heard a lot about you from Kevin and your mother. Oh, you've met Mom? I have. She showed me a photograph of you, too. I met you in person. I can see why she boasts about you so much. She was doing that. Mom! She, um, didn't say anything inappropriate to you, did she? She tends to lose control of herself when it comes to people as cute as you. <laughs> lose control? How? Uh, I'm sorry. I wasn't trying to be rude by calling you cute or anything. It's just that you're kind of quiet and really pretty, but you got this really unique aura about you. Unique? You're every bit as sharp as your mother. The goddess doesn't make him more unique than rice. Oh, please. Um, anyway? What are you planning to do now? Are you going to look for a way out of here? That's the plan, yeah. Though we made much of a dent in our progress so far, we barely started exploring when we found you. Oh, I see. If you don't mind, please let me help. Look, I won't get in the way, I promise. Even the way wouldn't be the issue here. And that's a tough one. My gut tells me you're better off staying here, to be honest. You've proven yourself to be made of sturdy stuff. Like I said before, this place is just one big, dangerous mystery. That's true. Then who say I'll be safe staying here on my own? If I'm going to be in danger, I'd rather go with you and at least try to help. Fair point, I guess. You're every bit as spunky as Estelle, you too, you know. <laughs> Can't be serious, Kevin. Trust me, she's a lot tougher than she looks. She went on the liberal arc and came back down in one piece. She's, plus, she survived Idios knows how many sketchy fights beforehand. Don't be quick to judge her because of her age. But still... Please, I really want to help. Do everything I can to make sure I don't cause you any problems. Really. All right, if you're sure. You mean it? You seem to understand the consequences of your actions and what it means to worry others. As long as that's the case, I've got no reason to say no. Still, please do be careful. Thank you, I will. Yeah, seriously. If anything were to happen to you on my watch, I'm sure my death at Erica's hands would be a slow and painful one. I swear, I won't let that happen. <laughs> Deal. All right, let's get back to work. Once Ethan's equipment is set up, it's back to exploring we go. Understood. Right. You know, let's get the little child a Gatling machine gun, because, okay, someone, I asked the question, who's more powerful, Elliot or Dita? And someone pointing out, she has a fucking minigun at her disposal. Kind of makes it unfair for, you know, Okay, she's already decked up with the cool stuff. For Elliot, so... Anyhow, I have to do some level grinding. No two ways about it. So, thank you guys for watching. If you have anything you want to say, make some noise down in the comments below. God knows, Idios knows, this is going to be a quite treacherous run. And don't worry, I will keep the death counter going when I'm level grinding. Because Lord... Adios knows I am going to die while trying to level grind. But anyhow, thank you guys for staying weird. <laughs>